Today, I will show you how to make this simple electric motor. Towards the end of this video, I will explain how this motor works. So let's start this video. To make the motor, we need few things. Copper wire of 0.5 mm thickness. Two paper clips of metal. One AA battery. One round magnet and a piece of sandpaper. We also need a strong tape. To make the motor coil, we need to wrap the copper wire around this battery a few times. Remember to leave these long ends of wire to bind the coil on opposite sides. Now we take one end and wrap it few times on the coil to bind it. Then we will do the same on the other side also. Then we will put one of the straight loose end on a flat surface and rub it with the sandpaper. We rub it to remove insulator film from the copper wire. This rubbing makes sure that the current from the battery passes to the coil. Remember, we will do this only to one half face of the wire while other face still remains as it is. Then we will do the same on the other loose end of the wire. So both loose ends of the coil have the same side face rubbed with sandpaper. Other face still remains as it is. This makes sure that only half of the time the current passes to the coil. Now we will take one of the metal paper clip and unfold it to make an L shape like this. We do the same to the second clip also. Then we will take the battery and fix these clips on each terminal of the battery. We will use a strong tape to fix them.
this way current from battery passes through these clips now we will stick the round magnet to the battery like this our motor is almost ready we will put our coil on these paper clips such that two long ends touch these paper clips so let's put it as soon as you put the coil you could say it starts moving back and forth sometimes to make the motor work we have to give it a gentle push to rotate and then it keeps rotating itself the coil rotates because when current passes through it the coil behaves like a magnet and the round magnet on the battery repels and attracts creating the rotation but as soon as the shining part of the coil's end touches the paper clip the current stops in the coil and it stops behaving like a magnet this way the round magnet stops repelling or attracting the copper coil but due to the previous rotation the coil keeps rotating a bit further and due to this the rough side of the coil's long edges again touches the paper clip and it again behaves like a magnet the process keeps repeating i hope you like my video if yes then don't forget to subscribe and share it see you in the next video Till then bye